Hi guys, uh, this is a tutorial on sidechain reverb. I'm not sure if you are familiar with it, but uh, let me let me show you. Okay, so just open a, a, a new project, and then let's maybe just take the snare. I just want to name that snare, and then uh, reverb. Right, so uh, reverb. So, uh, so you've got uh, your snare on channel four, which is already there. Then your reverb. Um, what you want to do is uh, select your snare, and then on the arrow key of the reverb channel there, just left click and uh, link and uh, link it to that. And then you can actually go to the reverb and click on the channel. And then we're gonna just add a reverb. Um, let's just go for fruity reverb two, maybe. Um, dry channel down, ER channel, and wet all the way up. Just make it a bit bigger, maybe. Um, okay, so there's a reverb. Now you want to side chain that. So I'm just going to add Fruity Limited to that. Uh, put it to the compression on channel 1. Turn that almost all the way down. Um, put that knee up. Um, the ratio about there. I'm just going to put the settings there, um, which is here. It's already making a difference, but here's the trick with um, with playing with a reverb. So um, you will hear when I when I play with this knob, J, uh, you will hear the difference. Let's just put it on there. So um, you can also do that with any other instruments, maybe for uh, synth stabs or something similar. Um, I could uh, just take one of these, for instance, um, and um, let's that just put that to channel four, and um, hear how that sounds. So um, you just put the limiter off for a second. So, um, it's only with uh, that's the raw sound. Now let's let's just put the um, reverb on, and then the limiter. So you can hear um, there's a delay on the reverb. So just set it here and um, play with the release and the head button. And um, yeah, till, till you get the sound that you are looking for. Um, hope you enjoy it. Please subscribe and um, yeah, see you on the next tutorial. Thanks.